talking to Alex from ongiznede.net, the Aromania website, which is a brilliant website, if I say so myself, but as long as you can read Indonesian. But even if you can't read Indonesian, you can look at the photographs. Alex is with me. Um, he may not always understand my English, so I might have to speak a bit slowly for him. Alex, let's start by saying, what is ongiznede? What is it? What, what does that mean? What is it? Ongis nade mean uh, ongis and nade. It it uh, it's reserve word in Malang. Ongis means singo and nade means edan. And in Indonesia it's even a singo edan. And in English, just call it singo edan. Uh, at crazy lion. And that's the Arabic nickname. That's Arabic. Yeah. All right. Now you have a website. You have a shop. You do photographs. How did it all? How did your story start? How did Ongis Nede begin life? I started uh, slowly at uh, 2007-2008 season. Uh, at the years, Arema coach uh, managed by Miroslav Janu from Cyprus yeah. Chess Republic Chess. Uh, I start with two of my friends, one uh, as photographer and one as a journalist. Uh, we start uh, write uh, articles, write the news, and take a photograph, uh, and uh, read a magazine, mm -hmm. bulletin. And now we have a we have a shop, we have a small office, and I hope it's done uh, uh, years and years and season to come. So it started off as a hobby, and yes, now it's become like a exactly start. So you have a job where basically you follow a football team that you love, and that's your job. Uh, <laughs> I am and my friend uh, maybe is a happily people. We have a job with uh, uh, our passion to the team, to Arema. Yeah. So we start at as Aremania, and now we have the job to the Arema team. So it must give you a buzz when you're going around town and you see kids wearing Ongis Nede t-shirts and Ongis Nede um, products, you must sort of think to yourself, okay, yeah, good, I'm making money out of it, but yeah. also, you know, I'm doing, I'm providing something that people want to buy. Uh, we learn from the European club, such as the English Premier League club and yeah. the Italian, Italian club. Uh, we learn to sell the, what what's the football means for supporters. Yeah. We have a jersey, we have a replica kit, we have a t-shirt, it's a scarf and supporters love to uh, buy the attribute of, the, of their club. They love to buy the Arimania attribute, so we deliver, deliver, deliver the attribute to the Arimania, not just at Malang, but all over Indonesia. And yeah. Last month, we sent our attribute to Hong Kong and Taiwan. Ongis Nadi goes internationally. Yeah. Go internationally. <laughs> But doesn't it mean, obviously from my point of view, I'm looking at it and I, I scream that why aren't the clubs doing this? And so it's taken you guys to start doing it yourselves and maybe you're the first people in Indonesia to do this for a football club, is that right? I don't think I'm the first people to do this in Indonesian football, but uh, I'm sure we, uh, Aremania and Arema Indonesia, uh, only started actually, uh, still learning to uh, to this uh, uh, in football industry, yeah. uh, we have to manage uh, our, our product, our brand. Arema have a good brand, yeah. brand to the Aremania. Yes. Uh, maybe, yeah. I'm, maybe I'm not the first, but um, we have to still develop to the uh, football industry. And now, because you have um, you have the shop, yes, we have the shop, kind of um, uh, cozy. But you have big, you have plans to expand that, yeah. Yes, we have to expand the shop. Uh, maybe next month we, we go to the new place with the, our new place. Uh, the, our, is our project the next month. There are three floors, and the first floor is a cafe, Ongisnade Cafe, and the second floor is this uh, our, our Ongisnade shop, our distro, and the yeah. third floor is our office, Ongisnade office. So again, you're bringing it all together. You also do, as an Ongisnade. Monthly ma is it monthly magazine or how often? Yes, Ongi Sade. Uh, not, not monthly magazine, but uh, the first edition of Ongi Sade magazine is in last season. Right. At, uh, maybe at the month of January or February. It, 
uh, we have three editions of Ong Isadi magazine and after three editions we stop it because uh, many many uh, projects we have to uh, finish and uh, now uh, at the start of the, of the season we, we have to uh, prepare to match the Ong Isadi magazine program mm. we have just released the Ong Isadi magazine program after Arema versus uh, Persijap Jepara so that was, a, I think that was the first for Indonesia, certainly there's no other team I've come across here anyway, it does a match day program. Yeah, I, I asked, asked the, my friend at the supporters club, mm -hmm. hey, have you uh, always a uh, match day program for your club, match, match, match day program for your club? Uh, I was I, uh, surprised, they asked, they asked to me, what is match day program? <laughs> <laughs> they don't know what's a program. <laughs> the, Okay, and after that, uh, it's just uh, to start start the match day program uh, regularly at every home game. Uh, but the, the match day program and the magazine are they available? Do you sell them in the shop or in the stadium yet? Uh, after the third edition, we just uh, make a free free edition of uh, Ongi Sade match day program. It's uh, done. Uh, you can. Supporters, our our supporters and Aremania can download it free at ongisade.net. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe at the end of the season, uh, Ongisade will release Ongisade magazine. It contains a season review, Arema Indonesia season review, right. 2009 and 2010. Wow! And you you sell that? Actually, we sell. Yeah. Certainly, you've been given the. Yeah, yeah. I, I go to football in Thailand and Singapore. Yeah. So in Thailand. A few teams there doing match day programs, and you know, lots of like your magazine, lots yeah. of information. Now, I suppose the big question is: we talked about Angus Nader. Let's talk about Arima. Uh, do you think they're going to win the title? Uh, as for this, definitely Arima. Uh, we we have believe Arima will lift the title this season, uh, but it's a long way. It long way to the title. It's a eight eight game to go. Mm -hmm. And we have to play away to Jayapura mm -hmm. and Wamena. Everybody know that's a talk. Are you going? No, I'm not going to Jayapura, but I will uh, go to Pakanbaru and Jakarta mm -hmm. at the final, the final match of this season. What about at the start of the season, Arama made a few big high profile signings like Noel Amshah, Ridwan. How the Singapore lads been, for your, in your opinion, in the team, how they played? I'm signed Ridwan. Yeah. Uh, Alam San Ridwan uh, almost the new sim symbol of Arema. Uh, every Arema <laughs> loves to uh, play their set. Ridwan number six and Alam San number twelve. Yeah. Uh, I think uh, when we lost uh, by Haki and Mustafa Kwadud into Persija, we lost the Singaporean star. But then Ridwan came. And the uh, collaboration of Alamsa and Ridwan, uh, very, very, very important. They, 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 uh, big, big impact to Arema to uh, top of the table. Yeah. Who? Okay. Final question here for you. Put you on the spot. This will be seen by quite a few people, maybe in Singapore. Who do you think is the more popular player with the Aramania? Is it Noah Amsha or is it Mohamed Ridwan? Which T-shirt sells the most? Uh, Alamsa. But uh, for Aremanita, you know Aremanita? The, yeah. the, uh, the women's The women's of Arema. They lost to Mohamed Ridwan. <laughs> <laughs> but I think uh, they, both of, both of them, uh, give uh, new new hero for Aremania. They uh, very, very, Aremania lo 